Hi, I'm Jacob Socialite. Fuck you. This is my life. I love to party plan and I fucking love music. Teacher says that I've been naughty. I must learn to concentrate. But the girls, they pull my hair and with the boys, I can't relate. Daddy says I'm good for nothing. Mama says that it's from him. Manic sister thinks I'm cracking. Brother says it's in my dream. Rise and shine, you lazy slut. Time to get off. Would you hand me my slipper? And I'll take my orange juice and a brandy snifter. I'm a great lover and a better listener. Oh, what you said, something. Were you talking to me? The costume party. And, um, I love having theme parties, so everybody's gonna dress up tonight. I got people coming in as Bonnie and Clyde, Barbie. I'm gonna be a street hustler. So I'm gonna wear, um, a ripped up, like, wife beater and, like, write, like, $30 and have, like, an arrow pointing, like, to my face. And, um, or like a backpack with like condoms falling out and like a mouthwash. So, it would be cool. <laughs> Hey bitch, what's up? Sorry, Heather, I can't be in your fashion show tonight. I'm busy, but maybe next time. First, I'll make like some good money. Like, I know a couple of friends that are like, yeah, I'll let them do me. Just buy me some Jack in the Box afterwards, you know? Oh, and one of my friends totally made like, well, I guess if there's a girl hustler, a prostitute, or whatever, she totally was like. It's weird though, because a lot of people I know that do hustle actually make money, which is really weird. So, <laughs> like, uh, my friend had like a lot of money and everything, but she was just like, "Yeah, sure, I'll let them do me and buy me some cigarettes afterwards." I'm like, "That's to each his own." The cinematic scenes that make my heart pout couldn't be bad karma for their luxuries, things I could not have lived without. And that's like about this boy that came into my life, and I felt like. Um, I had kind of like played with people's hearts and um, a lot of guys that I had crush or had crushes on me and um, I kind of blew them off and I don't know, hurt them and then I ended up falling for this person that changed my life and um, I wanted to say that it was bad karma that he came into my life but it couldn't be bad karma because they're some of the most beautiful times I've ever had in my life and I'm just like thankful to have them and I look forward to having more in the future and so it's just like it can't be bad karma and that's like a song I'm working on. So. advice I'm giving myself about um, people in the past that have like moved me or that I fell in love with and I just try to give myself advice or somebody else that in the future is going to hear it it can help them or help me and so it's kind of like kind of like um therapeutic like really therapeutic so it feels good to write like lyrics and stuff. He's actually not conceited at all but he should be because he's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Like he knows he's gorgeous but he's also insecure at the same time which is cool about it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. He just says shit that everyone wants to say, but then she can't say. Ah, crap! He's turning me on a little bit. I thought it was a mission. I think she was. Yeah, she's a big one. She's eating a lot of calories. Yeah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Would you like to eat? Yeah! Oh my god! 
you get them on the show? On what? Not the end. You definitely <laughs> Okay, see the girl with the super, super blonde hair? That's Ashley. I've known her since I was in first grade, and we still know each other. It's always good to know that you made somebody's day a little better. If they just come to your house and drink with you and laugh and listen to music and you just share good times, it always makes the day. I'm <laughs> 